Welcome to quiz time. I'm your quiz master, Sean, and I've got 100 questions about the 80s. What fun! So, plug your brains in, and let's see what we remember about the 80s, shall we? Beginning with question number one. What was the peaceful separation against the communist regime in 1989 called? The Prague Spring, the Velvet Revolution, or the Warsaw Pact Dissolution? It was the Velvet Revolution. In which country did the Velvet Revolution happen? Was it Czechoslovakia? Was it Poland? Or did it take place in Hungary? The Velvet Revolution happened in Czechoslovakia. What political scandal in the 1980s involved secret arms sales and funding rebels? The Iran-Contra affair, the Watergate scandal, or was it the Teapot Dome scandal? It was the Iran-Contra affair. Which former U.S. president does many historians credit for ending the Cold War? John F. Kennedy, Richard Nixon, or was it Ronald Reagan? The credit is often given to Ronald Reagan. The Pan Am Flight 103 bombing over Lockerbie, Scotland in 1988 was a terrorist attack attributed to which country? Libya. Which summit meeting occurred in 1986 between the United States and the Soviet Union? Was it the Geneva Summit? Was it the Helsinki Summit? Or was it the Reykjavik Summit? It was the Reykjavik Summit. Who were the leaders involved in the 1986 Reykjavik Summit? Ronald Reagan and Mikhail Gorbachev, Richard Nixon and Leonid Brezhnev, or Jimmy Carter and Yuri Andropov? It was Ronald Reagan and Mikhail Gorbachev. What international sporting event did South Korea host in 1988? Was it the Summer Olympics? Was it the FIFA World Cup? Or was it the Winter Olympics? South Korea hosted the Summer Olympics. The 1989 Tiananmen Square protests for democratic reform occurred in which country? Was it Japan? Was it China? Or was it North Korea? It was China. Which treaty was signed in December 1987 by the United States and the Soviet Union? The INF Treaty, the START Treaty, or was it the Warsaw Pact? It was the INF Treaty. What is the term for the economic policies of President Ronald Reagan in the 1980s? We called it Reaganomics. Which British Prime Minister implemented economic reforms known as Thatcherism in the 1980s? Margaret Thatcher. Thatcherism. What is Margaret Thatcher often referred to as due to her strong leadership style? The Iron Lady, the Combatant, or the Strong Woman? She was the Iron Lady. Which iconic car brand produced Testarossa in 1984? The Ford, Ferrari, or Toyota? Who produced a Testarossa? That would be Ferrari. What was the first mass-produced car model to feature a navigation system in 1981? Was it the Ford Taurus? Was it the Honda Electro Gyrocaster? Or was it the Toyota Camry? 
It was the Honda Electro Gyrocator. What toy did Ideal Toy and Novelty Company rebrand in 1980, originally named the Magic Cube? The Rubik's Cube, the Petaminx Cube, or the Cube Tetrahedron? It was Rubik's Cube. What console game did Nintendo create in 1985? The Metroid, Super Mario Brothers, or The Legend of Zelda? Nintendo created Super Mario Brothers. In 1986, what game did Nintendo release that introduced the character Link and the Land of Hyrule? Metroid, Super Mario Brothers, or The Legend of Zelda? It was The Legend of Zelda. What was Nintendo's first handheld console that they released in 1989? Game Boy, Virtual Boy, or Game & Watch? It was Game Boy. Which revolutionary music television channel made its debut in 1981? It starts with an M. MTV, and they actually showed music videos too. What was the first music video played on MTV? Thriller, Billie Jean, or Video Killed the Radio Star? Video Killed the Radio Star. What series featuring anthropomorphic turtles trained in ninjutsu was created? in 1983. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Which game debuted the popular game character Mario in 1981? Was it Super Mario Brothers? Was it Donkey Kong? Or was it The Legend of Zelda? Donkey Kong. What brand released the song, Every Breath You Take, in 1983? Which band? Was that U2? Was it The Police? Or was it Duran Duran? Oh my, am I feeling nostalgic. It was The Police. What was the term coined in the 1980s for the group of young actors often cast together in coming-of-age films? The Brat Pack? The Teen Squad? or the Youth Ensemble. It was the Brat Pack. What Brat Pack movie featured a group of teens navigating high school on a Saturday morning? Sixteen Candles, The Breakfast Club, or Days Off's Morning? It was the Breakfast Club. Who played the character of Alec Newberry in the 1985 film St. Elmo's Fire? Rob Lowe, Andrew McCarthy, or Judd Nelson? It was Judd Nelson. What bead product did Simplicity Creative Core first introduce in 1981? Hama beads? Pixel pops? Perler beads. They produced Perler beads. In 1986, a nuclear disaster occurred due to an experiment gone wrong with a poorly designed reactor. Where did this event take place? Chernobyl, the Ukraine. What global agreement addressing the depletion of the ozone layer was signed in the late 1980s? It was the Montreal Protocol. When exactly was the Montreal Protocol adopted? September 16, 1987, March 16, 1988, or January 1, 
1989. It was September 16th, 1987. When exactly was the Montreal Protocol entered into force? September 16th, 1987, March 16th, 1988, or January 1st, 1989? It went into force January 1st, 1989. Which 1982 documentary has a title translated as Life Out of Balance? Tawa Maxin, Mask Apeth Tawa Kehayan, or Kaa Anikskatsi? Kaya Anikskatsi, I think. Which American artist was diagnosed with AIDS in 1988? Was it Keith Haring? Jean-Michel Basquite or Andy Warhol? It was Keith Haring. Which American artist tragically succumbed to a heroin overdose in 1988 at the age of 27? Keith Haring, Jean-Michel Basquite or Andy Warhol? It was Jean-Michel Basquiat. The 1980s saw the emergence of what British group for young artists? It was the young British artists, the YBAs. Which artist, the most notorious of the group, organized the young British artists in 1988? Was it Tracy Eamon, was it Damien Hirst, or was it Gilbert and George? It was Damien Hirst. What annual event, first held in 1986 on a San Francisco beach, includes burning a human sculpture? Burning Man. Which virus, initially documented in 1981, was identified as the culprit behind an epidemic? Influenza, HIV, or SARS? That would be HIV. What groundbreaking antiretroviral drug was approved in 1987 to help in the treatment of HIV and AIDS? AZT, aspirin, or Zytovuline. AZT. What year was the virus causing hepatitis C discovered? Was it 1983? Was it 1985? Or was it 1989? It was 1989. Where did Prince Charles and Lady Diana tie the knot? Westminster Abbey, St. Paul's Cathedral, or did they tie the knot at Notre Dame de Paris? It was St. Paul's Cathedral. When did Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson have their royal wedding? July 23, 1986, August 2, 1987, or September 12, 1988. Their wedding took place on July 23, 1986. What year did the Space Shuttle Challenger disaster occur? Was it 1984, 1986, or was it 1988? The Space Shuttle Challenger disaster occurred in 1986. Who was the first American woman to fly in space and participate in missions during the 1980s? Was it Mae Jemison? Was it Sally Ride? Or was it Valentina Tereshkova? It was Sally Ride. What was NATO's military exercise conducted in November 1983? Arctic Circle 83, Able Archer 83, or Cold War Shield? in 83. Cold War Shield 83. It was Able Archer 83.
Which movie topped the charts as the highest grossing film in 1989? Was it Batman? Was it Lethal Weapon 2? Or was it Rain Man? The highest grossing film in 1989 was Batman. What was the first commercially available cellular phone made in 1983? The Motorola Dynatac 8000X? Ericsson Mobira Senator or the NEC 9A? It was the Motorola Dynatac 8000X. What was the short undeclared war between Argentina and Britain in 1982? The Falklands War, the Cuban Missile Crisis, or the Gulf War? It was the Falklands War. What British warship caught fire after being hit by an Argentine missile during the Falklands War? HMS Invincible, the HMS Sheffield, or the HMS Hermes? It was the HMS Sheffield. Why was Argentina defeated in the Falklands War? They were outnumbered on land, political betrayal, or poor strategy and logistics? It was poor strategy and logistics. In a speech delivered in 1983, how did President Ronald Reagan characterize the Soviet Union? The Iron Devil? Were they the evil empire? Or were they the axis of evil? They were the evil empire. Which U.S. military operation in 1983 aimed to restore order in Grenada? Operation Desert Storm, Operation Urgent Fury, or Operation Eagle Claw? It was Operation Urgent Fury. What was not a goal for Operation Urgent Fury? Protect the U.S. students, restore democracy, or eradicate British influence? It was to not to eradicate British influence. Which Caribbean leader was killed in 1983, leading to the U.S. intervention in Grenada? Maurice Bishop. Who led the coup that killed Prime Minister Bishop and harmed other cabinet members? It was Bernard Coard. Which 1980 U.S. military operation aimed to rescue American hostages in Iran but failed? Operation Desert Storm, Operation Urgent Fury, or Operation Eagle Claw? It was Operation Eagle Claw. What was the first affordable home computer that was popular in 1982? Was it the Macintosh? Was it the IBM PC? Or was it the Commodore 64? It was the Commodore 64. I love that computer. Which, computer, which, com, which company introduced the first commercial PC with a graphical user interface, a GUI, in the 1980s? Was it Microsoft, Apple, or IBM? It was Apple. What was the first personal computer with a GUI introduced in 1983? Was it the Lisa? Was it the Alto? Or was it the Macintosh? It was the Lisa. Where was Tim Berners-Lee working when he proposed a system that laid the foundation for the World Wide Web in 1989? He was working for CERN. Which arcade game was the first ever stealth game launched in 1981? 005, Metal Gear, or Castle Wolfenstein? 
it was 005. Which company developed the 1987 launched game Double Dragon? Capcom, Konami, or Technos Japan? Double Dragon was developed by Technos Japan. Which Russian computer engineer developed Tetris in 1984? Vladimir Putin, Alexei Pajitnov, or Mikhail Gorbachev? Well, of course, of those three choices, it's Alexei Pajitnov. Which 1982 sitcom followed the lives of individuals who frequented a fictional Boston bar? Was it Cheers? Was it The Cosby Show or was it Miami Vice? It was where everybody knows your name. Cheers. Who played the character Detective Sonny Crockett in the 1980s television series Miami Vice? Was it Don Johnson? Was it Edward James Olmos? Or was it Philip Michael Thomas? Sonny Crockett was played by Don Johnson. In Back to the Future, 1985, what is the name of the scientist who invented a time-traveling car? Was it Marty McFly? Was it Biff Tannen? Or was it Doc Brown? It was Doc Brown. Who performed Flashdance? What a feeling in 1983. Was that by Gloria Gaynor, Irene Cara, or was it by Jennifer Beals? It was Irene Cara. And now I have an earworm. Who sang the theme song for the 1984 film Ghostbusters? Huey Lewis in the News, Ray Parker Jr., or Kenny Loggins? <laughs> Ray Parker Jr. And now the earworm is gone. <laughs> Which duo topped the charts in 1985 with the hit Shout? Here's for Fears, Wham, or Eurythmics? It was Tears for Fears. What studio album did Kate Bush release on September 16, 1985? Never Forever, Kick Inside, or Hounds of Love? Hounds of Love. Which British rock band released the album Brothers in Arms in 1985? Was that U2? Was it Dire Straits? Or was it The Police? That was Dire Straits. What film in 1985 follows the adventure of young kids looking for a pirate treasure? The never-ending story, the pirate bride, or the Goonies? That's the Goonies. The 1987 film, The Princess Bride, was directed by whom? Rob Reiner, Steven Spielberg, or was it directed by George Lucas? The Princess Bride was directed by Rob Reiner. Which footwear brand encouraged consumers to just do it during the 1980s? Was it Adidas? Was it Nike? Or was it Reebok? Just do it, said Nike. What advertising firm coined the now long-standing slogan of Nike in 1988? Whedon and Kennedy, Saatchi and Saatchi, or Ogilvy and Mather? That was Whedon and Kennedy. Which U.S. president declared, Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall in his 1987 speech? That was Ronald Reagan. What pop culture figure declared, I pity the fool 
in the 1980s. That was Mr. T. What catchphrase did Wendy's introduce as a slogan in 1984? Where's the beef? What report released in 1983 described the poor educational system in America? A Nation at Risk, The Coleman Report, or Brown versus Board? That report was A Nation at Risk. Which television series became a popular tool for teaching children in the 1980s? Was it Sesame Street? Was it Barney and Friends? Or was it The Magic School Bus? It was Sesame Street. Which legendary pop artist was tragically shot and killed in 1980? Was it David Bowie? Was it Prince? Or was it John Lennon? It was John Lennon. Who won the Oscar for Best Actor in 1988 for his role in Wall Street? Michael Douglas? Jack Nicholson? Or was it Robert De Niro? It was Michael Douglas. When did the Exxon Valdez accidentally spill oil in Prince William Sound, Alaska? March 22nd, 1985, March 14th, 1987, or was it March 24th, 1989? It was March 24th, 1989. What popular toy introduced in 1983 became a cultural phenomenon and a symbol of 1980s childhood. Was it the Cabbage Patch Kids? Was it Rubik's Cube? Or was it Tickle Me Elmo? It was the Cabbage Patch Kids. Which highly contagious disease did it, who the WHO declared as eradicated in 1980? Was it polio? Was it smallpox? Or was it the measles? Smallpox. When did the Ethiopian famine start and end? 1980 to 1986, 1982 to 1986, or 1983 to 1985? 1983 to 1985. In 1985, which international music charity event brought together numerous artists to raise funds for Ethiopian famine relief? It was Live Aid. Which charity song, penned by Bob Geldof and Midge Ewer in 1984, aimed to generate funds for Ethiopian famine relief? Do they know it's Christmas? What 1988 film featured Michael Keaton as a bioexorcist hired to scare away unwanted residents? Was that Beetlejuice? Was it Batman? Or was it Edward Scissorhands? It was Beetlejuice. Which political figure was defeated by George H.W. Bush in the 1988 United States elections? Was it Jimmy Carter, was it Walter Mondale, or was it Michael Dukakis? He defeated Michael Dukakis. What defensive program did President Reagan propose in March 1983? United Star Wars, Operation Defense, or the Strategic Defense Initiative? The Strategic Defense Initiative. What album did Michael Jackson release in 1982? Was it Thriller? Was it Bad? Or was it Off the Wall? He released Thriller. 
when exactly was The Little Mermaid released? November 17, 1986, November 17, 1988, or November 17, 1989? Little Mermaid was released November 17, 1989. What legal case in 1986 was about a former employee suing the vice president of a bank? It was Meritor Savings Bank v. Vinson. What 1983 movie was about hacking into a military supercomputer nearly causing World War III? Was it War Games? Was it Tactical Intrusion? Or was it Battlefield? It was War Games. Who was the school teacher aboard the shuttle Challenger when it tragically exploded in 1986? Was it Sally Ride? Was it Krista McAuliffe? Or was it Mae Jemison? It was Krista McAuliffe. Which North American volcano erupted in 1980? leading to extensive ashfall and disruption in regional air travel. That was Mount St. Helens. What slang in the 1980s refers to a successful young urban professional? Those would be yuppies. And question 100. In 1983, which television network broadcast the provocative film The Day After? Was it ABC? Was it CBS? Or was it NBC? It was ABC. Thank you so much for playing Quiz Time. Drop your score in the comments, please. And don't forget to subscribe, ring the notification bell, and give us a like. This has been Quiz Time. We'll see you in the next one.